So, I recently got a phone call. Hello, by the way. How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. I recently got a phone call from my good friend Steve Lockhart over at Lockhart's Authentic, and he had a very interesting request of me. He said, hey, we've got our Any Cent, Any Hold sale going on right now until Sunday, December 5th, I believe it is. It's this coming Sunday. So he said, I thought it'd be cool if we sent you all 15 cents uh, for the cent, any cent, any hold, and you did a tiered rating video. Now, I had two thoughts on this instantly. My first thought was, what the hell is a tiered rating video? Never heard of that. Had to Google it, had to YouTube it, watch a few videos. It's actually very simple. I had just never heard of it. I'm sure some of you have. I figured it out fairly quickly. It's a, it's a very simple, uh, simple thing. Second thing, though, tiny little thing. Um, I have a fragrance allergy. Steve, why would you have the guy with the fragrance allergy rate your fragrances? This is like having a doorknob rate Italian food. I mean, I, I mean I'm just saying, I, I don't really know how this is going to go. I'm, I'm going to be completely honest with you. I don't know how this is going to go. I mean, worst case scenario, an asthma attack. Best case scenario, we get through the video. I, I Anyway, we're gonna. I'm not one to back down from a challenge, so I am going to do this. I just want to make it clear. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do this, Steve. I'm doing this for you, pal. I'm doing this right now. I have all 15 cents, and I have set up the tiered rating system based on what I found on Wikipedia. So I've never done this before. I have it set up, and I don't know who made this tier thing, but it absolutely makes zero sense. I mean, I've gotten sticky notes right in front of me, and it's, it corresponds to the chart that you can see here on the, the screen here. And basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one, I'm going to tell you what it is, and then I'm going to place it in one of these categories, S, A, B, C, D, F. I think there's supposed to be an E there. I tossed that out. I didn't think it made any sense. S stands for superb. I read again from what I gather. A, we're going to put as very good. B, good. C, as average. D, acceptable. And F, for fail. By the way, I've got so many texture tonics in front of me right now. I, I'm. How am I ever going to get through all of these? I have no idea what I'm going to... I have 15 bottles of it. This is unbelievable. First one up is Demigod. Demigod, first one up. Let's take a look at this here. Oh, this one's actually not bad. It's very fresh. I kind of like that one, actually. Like, I don't want to put anything in the superb category right off the bat, you know? Uh... Am I able to like switch things later? I this is hard. Okay, I'm gonna put this one in very good. I'm gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna set this one here. I'm gonna put that there. Let's move here. We're going into Deadly Nightshade. I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. Deadly Nightshade. I should. I want, is there a way to like cleanse your palate between smells? I don't know. I know nothing about this here. Deadly Nightshade. Ooh, that's got like that's like a leather. There's a there's leather in there. It's almost like a, a new car let... Wow. This one, you know, it's a little intense for me, I'll be honest. It's a little intense still, but it's not terrible. I'm going to put this one in the average. Moving over now, Nuclear Winter. Nuclear Winter. I have no idea what to expect for this one. I have not smelled any of these beforehand, by the way. This is, this is my first reaction to all of them. Whoa. Oh, talk about nuclear. Gee, gee. Good lord, I'm going to have to... Ugh. <laughs> this is going to be embarrassing. This is not... It's not... I mean, I can I can pick it up. It's just choking me, obviously. I'm... Oh, wow, this is difficult. I'm going to put this one in the acceptable category. I know that I'm not doing a lot of descriptions for you guys because, again, I'm doing the very best I can. This one's called Havoc. Let's uh, take, a, take a deep breath, fresh auction, before we dump into this one jump into this one. I think I just said dump into this one. That doesn't make sense. Whoa. Good God. Steve, what do you do? Is this a prank? Like I'm starting to one. God, Steven, this one. Oh, Jesus. All right. Sorry, buddy. I love you very much, but that's got to go in the, that's got to go in the bad. Whoa. We're back. Okay. We're good. I took a quick second. We're good. Let's move on now. Okay, this one I have smelled. I lied. I have smelled this one just because I've gotten in the past. This is Aventus. Everybody smelled this one. I didn't know that that was in here, but this is uh, 
This is one that I've smelled. I love Aventus. I love it. I love Steve's version of Aventus too, because people buy it from different places. You know, I've, I've used it in the past and got it from different places. And I, like, it depends on where you get it. It's their interpretation of Aventus. I've got the actual cologne and this is very, very close to the actual Aventus. And, oh man. I love that one. I'm going to put that one in the superb category just because I, I love Aventus. I, I know it's it's like so standard and everybody uses it, but I just, I love it. I love it. Up now, Malang, Malange, Malangi, Malangi. I don't know how to say that. What is this? Let's uh, let's dive into it and see what we got here. Good God. That one. Ah. Oh. Steve, this is this one's gonna kill me. I feel like I'm harming myself doing this here. Sorry, buddy. That one's that one's gonna be uh yeah, that one's going over there with the other one that almost destroyed me a second ago. Ooh, hopefully this one's better. We're, this one's called Winter Frost. Hopefully, uh I mean it sounds good, so bottoms up. Okay. Okay, that one's not bad. I mean, it's choking me up a little bit. I'm going to put that one in the in the good category because that one, that one's pretty good. It's not terrible. Nocturne is up next. Not, yeah, Nocturne. Okay, that one's a little, that one's got like some incense type in there, but it's it's got some sweetness. Where to put this though? I don't, where do I put this? I'm going, I think I'm going to put this one under the average one. I'm going to put that in there because it had that, that sweetness somewhat acceptable. Philosopher. I've seen him post about this one, but I've never actually smelt it. Let's. Let's take a look and see what this one has going for it. Oh god! Now see that one smells like the other one to me. This is the uh, this is gonna get very hard. This one smells like that Nocturne one to me. And it's got a little bit. I think there's a little bit more emphasis on the sweeter notes on that one. That one uh, like it still hits me a little. But on this one, I think this one's actually a little better than the Nocturne. I'm gonna put this one in the good category. Macro solution. That's up next. What the heck is this, Stephen? Macro solution. Kind of sweet, fresh, clean. I swear I've smelt that in a shampoo before. That one's good. I like that one. I, I do actually like like this one, the macro solution. I'm going to put that one in the good category. I think that one's pretty good. All right, freedom. Freedom. Let's look at that one. It smells like Murica. Here we go. No, it doesn't. What the heck is this? I'm going to put this one in the good category too. I like that one. I don't know about the name, but I like that one. Is this a joke? Steve, unscented. <laughs> well, I guess we should see if we can... You can kind of get some ingredient smell in there, but very, very faint. I don't... Where do I put this? I'm going to put it in acceptable because I don't know where else to put it. All right, we've got three left. Bewitched. Bewitched. I'm a little afraid because, uh, I don't know, this one's just giving me a vibe that is going to be... Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh my god! I swear I've smelled like tattoo parlors that's that smell like that, or that is like a an incense shop where they smell healing, where they sell healing crystals, and uh, how to talk to the dead books. That's what that is. That's what that. That's what definitely that that is. Yep, yeah, that's going in that category. I'm sorry. That is just that was not good for me. Thrash. Here we go. I'm gonna need an oxygen tank when I'm done with this video. Good lord, this one's got leather in it as well. Just like, uh, just like that other one. So there's, there's like leather in there, but there's something else with it. There's definitely something else in there. It's, it, it's, it's either like a lighter leather or there's something in there. It's not relying on the leather. I'm going to put that in the good category though. Cause I, I kind of like that one. I like that one better. I'm glad I put that one over there. Uh, the first leather one last one. I'm not going to lie. I'm glad this is the last one. Oh my gosh. Alien spit last one. Here we go. Okay, that one's not bad for the last one. It's it's not it's not very punchy. It's not very in your face. I'm gonna let's see, put that one in the good category. That's what I'm gonna do with that one. And uh, that's it. That's all of them. We've got our entire uh, chart filled out there. You can see for yourself. That is how I would rate all of the scents available at the Lockhart shop right now for the any scent any hold sale going on again till this Sunday. Now. Keep in mind, like I've said a million times, I've kind of really messed up nose. So hopefully you at least found this entertaining. And if you want to check out any of these for yourself, a link will be in the description there for their sale. Once again, it's going on right now and it's done on Sunday. So if you're interested, 
check one of these out. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments section as well. I'd love to hear from you. And if you haven't already, you absolutely need to subscribe to the channel. It's a huge help to me. Thank you in advance for doing that. And before I forget, make sure you like this video. That's another thing that's a huge help to me. So thank you in advance for doing all of that. And thank you very much for joining me here today. Well, I at least hope you found this entertaining. I will be back though with one of my regular videos right here very soon. Take it easy. I'll see you next time.